Sort of monolith, probably gonna be- Wow, look at all this brown here! Oh, this pack is stacked. Assault, Chalice, Monolith, Dynamo, but then we have Twin, Opposition as well. Gonti also kind of good. Yikes. Uh, but yeah, how much time do we have on the Modern Horizons? Oh, that's right. It closes after the GP, so we're actually good. Kind of feel like just doing some Splinter Twin stuff. Normally I would just take Grim Monolith here, but uh, I'm gonna spice it up a bit. I'm gonna take a twin. I've already had some good opposition decks. Let's just do this. All right, follow that up with Negate's decent. Although I don't think I want to pick it this early. Probably just take Chromatic. Some fixing, some ramp. Let's me splash white pretty easily, which is a common theme with my Splinter Twin decks. That kind of sucks. Could take Thing in the Ice. Roast is not bad. I think I'd rather have the removal than the Thing. Pretty sure Thing wheels. Thunderbreak Regent or Sphinx's Revelation. Misty Rainforest, actually. I forgot. Didn't see it. Easy fetch. Yeah, fetches are too good. Now we just get a Steam Vents or a Volcanic Island or whatever. Nahiri. Hey, there it is. Alright. There's my White Splash. Ooh. So we can backdoor into like a... Not backdoor even. We can just... Start drafting like a uh, sneak attack Nahiri deck too. Bloodstained Mire here seems fine. Although if I take Temple Garden, Misty can then find a white source. But let's take another fetch for now. Ilharg, yeah, we saw it in the last draft. Mm -hmm. Feels good to three zero the very first draft of the day. <laughs> Uh, the very first draft in the new house, 3 0 easy. Fancy drapes. Well, there's, those are just the drapes that came with the, ooh, with the place. Again, the house itself was moving ready. Can't pass Tundra there, too good. Too good with Misty. Yo, Iggy for mayor, thanks for the seven months. Welcome back, everybody. Appreciate y'all. Hope everybody's doing well on this fine August 5th, Monday. First of his name. Anger's probably pretty good here. Hour kills my own Planeswalkers. I don't think I want Lyra. Just do that. Chalice Wield. So this was our initial pack that had the Monolith and the Dynamo and... Some other good cards, opposition. Uh, Vandal's probably awkward. I'll take it for sideboard, but it is a must, so. I don't think I'm running Mutavolt, but very low likelihood I'm running Phoenix. You don't like how this is starting off? Why not? Not the Pokemon. Regent? That's fine. Abyss Wincon, Bow Show. Alright, well that gives us a target for Nahiri, if nothing else. And we already have two ro Mana Rocks. Oh, I see Bayou for the, for the fetches. You're not wrong. What's up, Four Fingers? 45 months, whoo-hoo. Nope, not bad. She texted me that she said it took 15 minutes today. And we did it! Kind of. Got a sneak attack here. That's what I was hoping for. Mono red sneak attack? Sundering Titan now? Yeah. Okay. I think that's a, that's a fine pickup here. It's good with sneak and good with Nahiri. Passing some more fixing, but... 
Okay, there's Resto Angel for Kiki Jiki. Could also just jam the Niv here. Niv is pretty good. So, Mr. Urza's. All right, I'll take the Niv since I don't even have Kiki Jiki anyways. I'm gonna jam the Is It Charm. Card is very good. Start taking some more blue cards. Yeah, I, the mana base right now might be a little sketch, but dang, I really want to take Compulsive, but Worm Coil Engine is way too good with Sneak Attack. Sneak Attack's a sacrifice at the end of turn, not an exile, so you get any of the uh, dies abilities. <coughs> Give me. <laughs> yes! What's the difference between Jam and Jelly? Uh, I believe it's the methods of production, or what part of the fruit is used. Easy abrade. I don't remember the exact differences between jam, jellies, preserves. I know that's not what your question was intended to be, but I took it literally! Lightning strike? Meh. Lava Man's not terrible. Kira also okay if I want to. Yeah, I'll just take Kira. What's the difference between jam and peanut butter? I don't buy Costco packs of jam when I own a dog. <laughs> Dirty joke. Firebolt? Peanut butter is so delicious, though. Peanut butter and jelly. Hmm. We are not going to be able to cast this Niv Visit without Chromatic Lantern, it feels. Also, this Splinter Twin is currently terrible. Are you aching? Yup, yup, yup. For some bacon. Yup, yup, yup. I probably just have to take the canal like a smart person. It's not what I want to do. Champion of Wits is pretty spicy. Flame Slash, Ancestral Vision, but... Gotta take the fix, man. It came as three. That's what I've been told. Hey! Okay, there's the Pester Diddle for the Splinter Twin. All right, so I'm gonna cut the Regent, the Hellkite, probably the Sundring Titan. We have enough sneak attack targets, I think. Like, even if I don't have Emrakul, Kozilek, we still have a bunch of other pretty fat creatures. I am passing a Flooded Strand, which sucks, but I gotta go for the combo. Um, Colonnade is a little bit tempting, but I think I might need the careful consideration for this type of deck. Battlesphere. I guess that's one more fatty I wouldn't mind taking. All right. Oof. Yes, fixing is nice. Oh, we could show and tell too. This is a, such a good show and tell deck. Oh, I probably end up cutting Kira now that I'm running Splinter Twin because that's not a combo. Damn, Lotus, show and tell, Fumeral. And then we still have like Treasure Map, Shiv and Fire, Analysis, and Glorybringer. This pack is stacked for us. I think I might be able to wheel the show and tell. Yeah, I like taking the Lotus or the Fumeral here. I'm in. I'm in for it. Let's take a Fire Ice over Stratus Dancer. Oh, you're right. <gasps> Look at this! Such. Uh, Atarka's another pretty good one with Breach and Sneak, but. Let's just take some early uh, interaction. I'm gonna pass. If this was swords, I think I would take it over Flame Slash, but since it's not, I'll just take the Slash. Oh yeah, God. Electrolyze was also A+. Dude, this deck is nice. Wish I had a few more lands. In fact, I... Wow, am I not running Misty or Bloodstained Mire? Jesus. Oh, no, no, no. 
Misty finds Tundra. So we're okay there. But yeah, the Meyer's dead. Nah, Nahiri's too good. I have a feeling that uh, Show and Tell will wheel. A free fetch, but I don't have any... It doesn't have any value in my deck. Misty can already find... I mean, I could add the Savannah so that Misty could find two different white sources. I don't think that's necessary. This was the show and tell pack, wasn't it? Damn. All right. Oh, well. We have just like mono red built in our site. Well, no. It's like weird mono red. <sighs> I don't think I was going to run out of planes. I think that's enough white fixing. Just the Tundra and the uh, Misty. I think that's enough. Lands, anyways. We still have the Lotus and the Lantern, too. Alright. I dig it. Let's see. 14, 8, 9, 6, 7, 8, 9. Um, it's probably too much blue. Yeah. We don't need that much blue. Niv-Mizzet might be a little bit awkward, but we have Lotus and Chromatic Lantern to help for that. Plus, we can always just through the breach slash sneak attack, Niv-Mizzet in, and then draw a bunch of cards by casting a bunch of uh, other spells after the fact. It's not quite sneaky-jeaky, but it's close. All right, I think I'm gonna make another pot of coffee. I will be ready. Oh, I'll give you some trivias. Push, push. I'm a coming, I'm a coming, I'm a coming, I'm a coming. Oh yeah. Forgot I had some cold brew coffee downstairs. So instead of another pot, I'm just gonna drink some cold brew. Cold brew beer? That's right. Eh, keep it. Can't mulligan a chromatic lantern. A brainiac. Thanks that three months. What's the view out the window? Uh, it overlooks the mountains, uh, a river, uh, a field of beautiful flowers. Also ocean. <laughs> uh, I guess that just gets island now, right? Nah, you can see the Olympic pool out the other window. Some mirror match? Are they also gonna be twinning me? Twinning we twinning me and winning me? Well, I I can't have a pool and a helicopter pad on the roof. I mean come on. The Dancing Babes. Again, Emily's veto was cast. <clears throat> Tal. Ran, dan, 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 dan. I should have probably cast Careful Consideration in response, just in case they do counter. Alright, let's go for it. Well then, that resolved. Mm, casual.
Grim Monolith, Pestermite, Kiki Jiki, LOL. The Big D. What artifact will you steal? The Life Linker. So if Life Linker rocks here, they gotta fire. Yeah, alright. I guess they're not dead, dead. Until I draw this card! Can put him to one? No, it doesn't work. I can kill Talrand. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to throw, show them through the breach or anything, though, so... Bzz. But yeah, if I is it charm down the Talrand, then Worm blocks Worm, they go up to 5, then they take 4, go to 1. I don't know what opponent was doing over there. I thought they were going to have counters or something, but... They didn't even have those. So hasty creatures are probably going to be good versus them, or flashy creatures. From what we saw anyways. Might take out the ball and bring in the Hellkite then. Yeah, I think Hellkite is just always a good card to run. Yeah, but it's... I think it's too slow. Unless we're cheating it out. I guess if we cheat out... Um... And it's good enough. This hand looks great. The dream. Turn one, suspend ancestral. A hey, laboratory maniac. Thank you for the 21 months. You know what I should have done? I should have led with mountain and then played tundra so that I'd be able to hold up both helix and is it charm. That was just a mistake. I was just thinking about Wasteland, but they didn't show me Wasteland, and normally you shouldn't really play around stuff if you haven't seen it. Descent. Uh, this is like the big upstairs living space. Um, and then there are four, or I guess five rooms that connect to it. It's like an upstairs living room. I'm only here temporarily until I get my new desk in, and then I'll be moving over into the office. That's where Emily's computer is, as well. O-Stone. Okay. Um, might just win next turn. Oh my god! I am so sorry! I am so sorry! <laughs> Quite the draw step. Oh, snap keep, I got the chromatic lantern. And we can draw through the breach, or sneak attack, or any card draw effect really. Okay, and now we can also draw Pestermite. Burn spell. Burn spell. Burn spell! Non-helix. Castable burn spell. <laughs> nah, show and tell's not in my deck, remember? We didn't wheel it. All right. Insta win cards next turn. Probably sneak attack and through the breach. <laughs> oh, I might take a little bit too much damage here. They might pull a little bit too far ahead. Yeah, I'm dead next turn. I think I still loot? No, I guess maybe we're not dead dead, but we're pretty dead. It's a good blocker. They can overrun me this turn if they want to. I don't think that kills me. 3, 6, 9, 10, 19. No, it doesn't kill me. Easiest play of my life is just draw sneak attack to win. 
But I mean, we have a ton of good draws, assuming we live this turn. We might be dead. Any any uh, artifact removal kills me, pretty much. Is this dismember? No, paying life. Oh, oh, birthing pod, Green Warden. Combo. Well, they don't actually get any other card. All right. <sighs> Let's go deck. Well, I'm not dead, because I can actually kill the Garrick here, right? This would only leave me with two blockers, though. Or three blockers. I think I might actually need to leave a few back. I think pinging for three right now is good enough. As long as I keep it off of ultimate range for a turn. Oh yeah, I can never beat a hoof if they have it. If they just insta-pod, then we, you know we're dead. They haven't done that yet. And they just let Garrick die. They do have some big old plant boys. Oh, here comes the pod. Well, we'll see what they get. Again, if they sacrifice Avenger. Yeah, dead. Mm. Oh, wait a minute! That ain't a hoof boy. That's just a nasty. That's just a nasty. Also, I get to have a lot of elephants now. I think we might be in this still. Like, my board is better than theirs, I think. Whoa! Homie. Eat, 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 eat. I can't, like, instant speed a land on the battlefield, right? I'll take two. Hey, dude, it's leap! Thanks for the 42 months. Are they dead? This has to block here. That puts... Yeah, I think we win. I think we just win, right? They at least take five... Puts them to 10. They're taking... Yeah, they're dead. Uh, bruh. <laughs> bruh. <laughs> Cube is hard. No, no. Absolutely. Cube is hard. Force of Vigor! This is potentially a matchup for Star of Extinction. Also should probably bring in Shiv and Fire just for... Ah, uh, no. You know what? Look how much burn I have early game. I didn't actually realize, but I have a ton of early game burn. I don't need to bring in some more. Bolt, Slash, Abrade, Roast, Charm, Helix, Ice, Anger, Electrolyze. That's, that should be plenty. Yeah, I might not even need to sideboard too much here. I kind of like bringing in the Star, but... Yeah, we will. I'll take out Cozy. Uh, now remember, this does not find red. It's so good if I draw a red source, though. I think it's too risky. Bah! All opposite problem here. Uh, I might go down to five. Oh! <laughs> All 
All right, the perfect four. This is not the perfect four. Can I undo? I can't undo the card that I bottomed, all right. Wait, can I hit cancel? Oh yeah, okay, I can. I'm wondering if I want sneak attack or splitter twin more. I guess probably sneak attack. With splitter twin, I have to draw exactly pestermite. With sneak attack, I have like five outs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on, baby. Give me a land off the top. All right. In it to win it, baby. In it to win it. Pretty good mulligan to uh, four. Now would be a good time to draw that careful consideration. Whisper. That's a fast clock. <laughs> I probably got one more draw step before we lose here. They have library with uh, the manifest going on, which is kind of nice. I need. I want them to pay for life, and then I draw Emrakul. That would be ideal. Hmm. Damn. Yeah. Emrakul doesn't even win anymore. So I guess I do need to draw what? Just the Battle Sphere again. For blockers. Am I dead? Four, six, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Not quite dead. Technically not dead. I could also firebolt one of the manifests, but I think this gives me the most uh, likelihood of winning. The highest chance of winning. Because now I can draw a card draw spell into something. That is a lot of mana. Dang, look how good Anger of the Gods would be here. Doesn't kill uh, Whisperwood, but would exile everything else. Alright, that does it. GG. Oh yeah, it would have given me Starve Extinctions now too. Absolutely. Well, poops. It was a pretty good mulligan in the four. But just didn't quite get there. <laughs> God, it would have been nice to have a few more cards in my hand. God, I'm not a billionaire. Just a casual millionaire. Am I able to Grubhub to my new house? I would imagine so. There will be some grub hubbing in the near future, absolutely. I have literally claimed to be a billionaire in the past. Mm, no, I might have said like double digit millionaire before, but I'm certainly not a billionaire. Hey, what's up, J Bear? Is that 21 months? Look, guys, I have just over a thousand subs, as you can see by the carrots. Easy, easy millionaire. You guys can do the math. <laughs> we got a room just of money bags. I'm like Scrooge McDuck. Activate factory. Overgrown battlement. You know what that is killable with? A slashy slash. <laughs> Set up a GoFundMe for a leaf blower. Mr. Trax. Get it while the getting's good, I guess. Can I draw a Pestermite next turn, please? God. Damn, does it feel good to just kill every creature they play.
Terminate, 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 go. Yeah, I mean, they have a lot of mana again. And they have Trastodon in their hand, so. Game is still close. Zabaron! 68 months. Woohoo! Come back next month. Well, I'm gonna get some elephants, I would imagine. That is right, the Legacy Cube. The goodness fun times. 68 months though, man. Thank you so much for the four years of support. That's a lot of damages. I don't need to attack with that many. Because we're going to get four more next turn, assuming that our battle sphere doesn't uh, die. So, as long as I hit him down to at least 12. But this way I do, I can block with one, so. Now again, we're under the assumption that they don't have a Crater Hoof in their deck, because that one game where they... Uh, everything potted away their Avenger, they got Terrasta on and not Crater Hoof, which would have been lethal. So, they would have to natural order into Crater Hoof because they sacked some lands. You thought sub was an East Coast thing? I say sub sandwich. What's the very miscreant record? Probably like 9 or 10. At least. Oh, they just took it! Wow, what the mad lad! Holy moly. Well, I certainly hope they don't have a Crater Hoof. Just bamboozle me. I mean, what's the Wood Elves gonna do? <laughs> oh god, is this Natural Order? This is Natural Order! This totally looks like Natural Order cast. <laughs> if they get Crater Hoof here... What? <laughs> That doesn't make sense! Are you kidding? I'm so upset. Oh my god. GG's. <laughs> wow! I'm so upset. Did they just draw it too? Ugh, that's disgusting. Man, I'm sad that we lost with this deck, because this deck is so good. I'm going to blame it on the Mulligan to 4 and just salt Baby Rage. This deck is so sweet! Blame the Mulligan to 4. Yell about variants. Say something about how magic is luck-based game. Yada yada. I think that's... The correct play. Anyways, Ember Kit, thank you for the 25 months. Welcome back. Dude, wo Woodpecker is super old school. Their deck's, no, that person's deck was nice though, right? Given that they did have the Crater Hoof after all. I wonder if I should go tell my next door neighbors that they might occasionally hear yelling and screaming and that if they do it's perfectly normal please do not <sighs> oh my what the heck blue red black white what are you gonna tutor up <laughs> Sin Collector! I get to take an instant or a sorcery. Alright, that's fine. Don't care about that or that. Eh, kind of care about that, but... The 
This cold brew coffee only has 15 calories in it. I guess it's basically like... Very few calorinos. Better have another! <laughs> uh, uh, okay. No, it has no sugar. Literally zero sugars. Bam. Look at it. It's got like a... Is that a leopard? I think it's a leopard. Can't tell from that angle. Kirkland cold brew coffee. Eh, I'm gonna go ahead and warm coil here. Why not? I don't think they're gonna... Well, yeah, I don't think they're gonna block just to gain six life. Well, maybe I was wrong. Setzer, thanks for that seven months. And Casey Masterpiece with the two months. Welcome back. Nah, we just made a Costco run yesterday, or two days ago. As you do. And we need to go to like Home Depot and Ikea and stuff. Still have a lot of house stuff to do. Do they just f <laughs> Man, that sucks. No! We still have through the breach in our deck somewhere. But now I might be getting snuck, which is bad. One has two red sources. They could do literally anything. Oh boy. It starts. Token enchantment. This is an upkeep effect. Oh, Sundering Titan or something? Through the breach. You have more? Oh. Uh, I guess they take Helix. I'm just gonna let that resolve. I don't think they're gonna take Emrakul because they already got rid of my sneak attack. Which means through the breach. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Breach me. Yeah, it doesn't quite make sense that they would sneak attack. Uh, their click unless they had something else to do. Six cards in their hand now. All right, well, we're just going to pass. Like, they have to sacrifice those two creatures. <laughs> Honestly, that wasn't all that bad. So I'm going to ice one of their red sources prior to end of turn. So if I do an end of turn and they sneak attack something in, then they get to keep that creature until the end of my turn. No, I want to draw the card here. Okay. They are going to sneak something in right now? Sure. <laughs> uh, repeal. Oh, that's pretty good on my tokens. Damn. Wow, repeal is a sick hit. Uh, well, I'm gonna try to exile the sneak attack. Oh, the brawl making it cost two! They have forbid plus uh, consecrated sphinx as well. That's something to note for the next game. Shoot, homie. Thanks, hungry. Alright, this is just repeal, right? Oh, they do have another sneak attack? Champion of Wits, that's fine. Stupid like a fox, thanks man. 29 months. They're abusing me <laughs> with my own sneak attack. <laughs> I 
think Emily said she didn't want me to give a house tour. All right, go for the repeal. I'll counter the repeal. Now they're going to internalize their champion, play a red source and pass or something. Oh, tap land. Okay. Well, if they're just eternalizing here, we do have the flame slash and... Was that approach of the Second Sons? Oh god, through the breach, one time. Damn it. My hand is dog. Dog doo doo. They're not even gonna eternalize their champion? I think they'd want to eternalize. Yeah, here they go. Uh, oh, they didn't hold up red! Through the breach! Through the breach! Breach me! Please. Please. And we're dead. I'm gonna use the roast because they know about it. Plus Flame Slash can deal with the flyer later on. Uh, they don't kill me next turn, right? It's the turn after. A Typhoid. Thanks for the 35 months. One draw step to rule them all. Here we go. I hope they're just attacking with Colonnade this turn. <laughs> Esmost! 36 months. My god. So close to two years. Clearly. Thank you, thank you. Oh, what the heck was that? JK, JK, untap, untap. <sighs> oh, wait. Here we go. What is this? Cloud skate. Okay. Oh. Oop. That's unfortunate. Fractured Identity, still a hell of a card. Let's bring in the Titan. Let's bring in Regent, Phoenix, gonna cut Anger, Rose, Slash. Do I wanna bring in Star of Extinction? I don't think so. Could kind of electrolyze. Yeah, could. I don't. I don't think I need to bring in the Thundermaw. Yo, never stop swooping. Thanks, my friendo. Twenty months. They didn't have that many creatures. I conceded because they have. They had uh, approach of the second suns on top of their deck, and they had already cast it once. This only gets islands now, since we already drew a tundra. Yeah, maybe we can just race them with turn 3 Phoenix. Who did Delta? Ass. Click. No click. I think I'm gonna ice their fumarole and upkeep. Are they just gonna forbid this? No, they might click now? What? I don't understand. It's a good draw. You're as cold as ice. Willing to sacrifice our love. Seen it before. I want to use this charm as a counter, but I might just need to loot here.
I mean, I'm liking. I'm liking this. <laughs> uh, played around? Is it charm? Played around is a charm, I guess. I think if they play like their Sphinx here, I'm just gonna loot in response. <clears throat> Not. I'm actually gonna discard the bolt. In case I draw Sundering Titan. I'm guessing they bounce my elemental here, and then I can just try to firebolt the Teferi. Do do uh they've had a lot of standard cards. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Comes the clicky. JK. Horizon Canopy is. Dude, this guy's trolling big. Sheesh. Yo, Gil, bro. Thanks for that Twitch Prime sub. <laughs> of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next draw was through the breach. God damn it. It's not shuffled in, it's put on the bottom of my library. Oh my god, I'm about to just concede to save time. Doo -doo, doo -doo. This deck was so sweet, and I think it's gotten an unjust end! Bloodstained Mire? Yeah, now we can just put in the Bloodstained Mire as a shuffle effect, if, if we would go to game three. They discarded Consecrated Sphinx? How dead am I? Jesus. Now remember, they also have a... Uh, who's a what's it? Uh, fractured Identity in their deck too, so... I'm pretty surprised they didn't just buy that back. Maybe they have another counter. Uh-oh, this looks big. Oh, just approach. I mean, the approach doesn't matter right now, since they're beating me already anyways. I don't think there's anything I can draw anymore. <laughs> I still don't think there's anything I can draw. Why couldn't these pieces have come like a turn or two sooner? All right, well, we just won in two. Man, I thought this deck was awesome as well. Poops. GG's, though. GG's.